Well, I've been busy cleaning for a week or two. Don't that look nice? A lot of degreaser, a lot of cleaner. And then I put um, some paint, which you can put right over rust, changes rust. Real nice paint. Got everything done, all the hoses, all the wires. Ready to go. So now you can touch everything without getting dirty. Pretty cool, huh? So I got a couple lines I'm gonna change. Some lines that have been beat up and kind of weepy. High pressure line from the power steering. One of the transmission cooling lines gonna change that. I got a leaky seal down there that was uh, wet, so that's going to get changed. Spent a lot of time cleaning that up. I'm glad it's done. <clears throat> All the parts clean. All the nuts and bolts clean. Starter, exhaust, intake, turbo, water pump, front and rear plates oil pan oil cooler anyway it's all clean still waiting on stuff from the machine shop it's going to be another week or so before I get any of that I'm going to fix this right here that rusty crap from the battery That'll be fixed. Down here I've got all the stuff that bolts onto the motor. That's all clean. Ready to bolt on. Pressure washed all the inside of the fender. Intercooler. Radiator. All that stuff's been cleaned. I mean, neat little bucket. Sits on top of a five gallon bucket, just recirculates diesel or whatever. Worked pretty well. Cleaning up them parts. Then in here, I got all, everything, all the heads. I'm gonna get new injectors. You know, they've got 200, 250,000 miles. That's when guys say they start to give up. So I'm going to change those. Everything's been cleaned. Bathing in oil. Waiting for assembly. A new oil pump. That's what that is right there. Here's the other side. We have boxes of seals, new nuts and bolts, filters, sealer, oil pump. Here's some of the old gaskets. Yeah, I looked at them. I can't tell where and which one may have been leaking. Hard to say. Which should be good. I get it back.